YouTuber, Ultimate, Fat Bear, 2006. Your video is starting now. I want to show you guys something really cool. All right, let's go. Hey, if you'd like to skip straight to the animation, I'd suggest skipping right to here in the video. We good? Cool. Now, I'm not the best person to talk about this uh, game or whatever, but if you'd like to see a real YouTuber talk about it, talk to the person who made the game up here, or just, you know, a random YouTuber I found who does, he's garbage, but, you know, down here if you want him. Alright guys, time to teach you how to use stick nodes. Uh, I'm gonna have to change that from social media to camera stuff. Anyways, first you click on the app, and then you wait a little bit. Everybody tilt your screens weirdly because it's happening again. I still can't figure out how to fix this. But if I tilt, screen does not work for some people. So just bear with me. Okay. Now, right now, that you have a little stick figure in front of you that probably looks like this. You can't do too much with him, but check this out. There's gonna be dots on his body. If you, some dots do, every dot does something different. It controls the part of the body. Boom, boom. Now check this one out. Boom, 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 boom. And this very important one moves his body completely. Look at the top left of the screen. You're gonna notice a little character moving. That's frame number one. Now let's just get let's just move him over here for now. This oh yeah, if I go past this line, you can't see him. So let's go to I don't know. Let's just. Huh. We're gonna, depending on what you click, depends on what your options are. Now, you're gonna scroll down until you get to stick figure library tools. Now, you can import a stick figure or use the default ones the game gives you. Now, to get a stick figure, you'll have to go to somewhere called uh, sticknotes.com. Just look up stick notes, it should be like the first website that comes up. And boom. Now, what you can do here, get out of my face, is simple. Look, you can, you have the option of looking for characters, vehicles, weapons, effects, objects, blah, blah, blah. Check out some stuff. Uh, you can search something up and then filter or whatever. Like, let's just say Zelda. Now, let's just say, uh, let's go Zelda most likes. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Wow. Delicious. Now, right here, it says Majora Mask Pack Zip. You see the zip? It has zip. Do not download. Do not waste your time. Just die. Now, sometimes it says something a little different. I'm trying to find it. It says Triforce Nodes. You see the nodes part? If it ends in nodes, that's the way to go. Now, not everything is guaranteed to have one of these, especially packs. Almost every pack fails to have one of these. And I'm sorry for anyone who cannot find any. And anything that looks cool probably is a zip. Uh, I'm sorry, it's just how life works. It really is. You see? Okay, let me stop messing around and let's just get straight into this. Then, you can go over here. Let's try using one of the characters we just used. Uh, I guess Link 5. Now, this is Link 5. I guess. All you have to do is click on them. Also, you know it works if it has one of these. It shows the logo. Okay. Now, there's going to be a part of the body where you can move the character. You're going to have to find a certain dot that does that power. This is not it. This is not it. You may have to zoom in. Look at where the torso would be. And if it starts moving, then you found the body. Now, you have a lot of options. You can... You can flip, like this, or it's just, I don't know. 
we can flip on the X or Y. We have things to do, so let's just get on with it. Now, let's just set them up in a position or whatever. Just give them a simple pose. Uh, let's just say this is as basic as we're going to get. Boom. That's a nice pose. Now, you can do a couple things. You can, if you go to add stick figure, you can add more. They already have certain characters set up for you if you've already used one. You can uh, do some other stuff too. Now, here's an important part. How do you delete a character if you do not want them? You click on the character and you do delete stick figure. Now we're just going to do one more thing. One more thing. We're going to go all the way and just click anywhere on the screen that's not a stick figure word or anything. Just this white blankness right here. And you're going to go find the stick figure thing, stick figure library tools. And so say create new stick figure right there. Okay. Now let's try creating a stick figure. And it can be a look, it can look like whatever. You have basic tools and they all do something different. Let's say you wanted to have an arm. Uh-oh, I made a mistake. There's going to be a, on the top left, there's undo and redo. What happened? You don't want it, you don't want black people in this game? Well, that's kind of racist, but okay. Boom. What happened? You don't want it to be one color because that kind of looks ugly? Well, you're kind of picky. Boom. 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 Are you looking at the left side of the screen? Boom. That, that's starting to look cool, right? That looks like a character. No, it does not. Let's undo that. Now, let's think of a character. Uh, you know what? I'm going to just straight up make one of my... One of the characters from my plush series. Anyone who watches my plush series, basically any person who watches my channel, knows may know this character now we just to add a body part all you do is find the dot and then you just slide be careful because you may add more than you want to so make sure you click on none before touching one of these or you can add something to it now there's a really cool feature where you can actually add if you go all the way down well not all the way down uh you click on the piece of the body where the dots are and there's a chance that one of these is going to say Oh, I'm going to have to edit this video. It's going to say something like, I don't know, stretch? You can't do it on the body. You cannot edit the body in any way. But look, you can do, is stretchy. So boom. So now if you're, you can stretch this part of the body in any way. The other ones you can't. It's not a thing. You just wasted your time because you thought you could do something you never could. How do you feel, you idiot? Now, what happened? You don't like what you made? You're getting upset that I'm bullying you? Well, grow up, kid. This is a real world. I'm just joking. I'm a nice guy in real life. In fact, if I met you, I wouldn't talk to you. Ahem. Anyways, you made a character. Yay! You can save the character, or you can just... And you add it to library. If you want to save it, you give it a name and blah, 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 and press save. But I don't want to save it. Uh, I guess we just cancel. Yes, I'm sure. So yeah, let's make a basic animation right now. Because we don't have, we're, this video is too, uh, too long. So we're just gonna go back to what I showed you. Uh, let's go use, t -t -t. hmm. Hmm. Ah, yes. The anime is everywhere. Okay, we need to hurry this up a bit. You know what, let's just pick a random character. We're gonna go with McDonald's. Alright, just bear with me here. Okay, so let's add an animation. We're just gonna pull McDonald's man all the way here. We're gonna grab an item from the top real quick, because I actually need something. Uh, I'm just gonna say a wooden... Oh yeah, you can also look for the item like this. Remember, you can edit the item in any way. You can even go down to scale, and then boom. So yeah, what do you got right here? Cash register. Something like that. Now, this is your starting area. Your character looks basic and whatnot. You know, he's in a comfortable pose. Um, I'm not going to go too in-depth on this because there's a different YouTuber who's made the game who talks about this. But just for the people who don't care about that guy. Now, we're just going to save. Okay, we're just going to say, uh, McDonald's. Like, we're gonna save project. Okay, so let's just say this: the character walks like that. 
we're just gonna bend his knee a little and then boom we're just gonna you see this uh, we want to move him slightly so yeah there's like lazy ways to do this and then not lazy ways anyways let's see how that looks that looks garbage right well i think it does how does this look? Does this look any better to you guys? That's just I clicked on something called tweening. Now this could be bad or good depending on how it looks. But it actually makes the character fully slide or whatever. Rather than just doing this. See? Look at how much cleaner that looks. Uh, if you want to keep whatever it is you got... Here, squ Oh yeah, my weight, top right. Anyways. Let's say you are done. You wanna... I don't know. You're gonna go all the way to the top. You're going to go, obviously you save it. I don't know where that is. Save. Then you're going to export to GIF slash ping. You're going to click on GIF. And you're going to export GIF. I'm not going to do that because I'm going to actually make a whole video for you guys using these characters. That's right, you guys got a sneak peek. All right, guys. Well, I'm done with this. I guess the plushies are going to do the rest of the video for me. Uh, or something. Okay, guys. Peace out. Okay, time to show you what the Ronald McDonald video looks like when it is done. Let's go. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Hello, sir. Can I have a Whopper Jr.? What? Ah! Oh, yeah. Psh. I need my Whopper. Simply delicious. Yum, yum, yum. Mmm, good stuff. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it.